this to the federal government if by tuesday you don't release those children if by tuesday you don't release those children or children Aousa community the muslim community kids parents have to move to abuja to stay on our computer building close to the cell that these children are have the audacity to lie in the presence of everyone manipulate election you will register kids in your community for them to vote it is for how northerners are treated in nigeria northerners are still the problem of nigeria till today hello wonderful people welcome back to the channel it's me again evelyn unduka thank you so much for clicking on today's video very dark man against the federal republic of nigeria very dark man gave nigeria 48 hours to release the children in custody if they don't release them he's going to set up a go for go fund me account to release the kids no matter how small anybody can contribute we will contribute i'm not going to lie since i left the court on friday i've not been the same i've not been able to sleep i've not been able to eat properly I've not been able to even work out, which is one thing that I love to do most. Because I would like sleep on my bed. When the same children, the same minors, 10 years old, 11 years, 12 years old, that was with inside cell, are still being locked up. Without food to eat. See them lean, because their bones showing. Some of them fainting inside the courthouse. And I go sleep for my bed when I get the platform. I just want to say this. This video is not going to be long. This is to the federal government. If by Tuesday you don't release those children. If by Tuesday you don't release those children. We'll contribute that money that you want. We'll give it to you. And yes now. We'll set up a GoFundMe account. We'll gather the money ten naira. everybody go contribute how many followers i get one contribute to release those kids even if it's 10 10 kids a day as he said even if it's 10 10 kids a day we are going to contribute to you know release those children i don't know what is happening in nigeria i don't know on my last video i said ah it's too new to be blamed for this atrocity it's because obviously this law has been in nigeria system for a very long time but up to now tunubu has not released those children you will have the power to tell them to release those kids instantly because he is the head of nigeria he is the number one citizen of nigeria anything he says Will be implemented immediately but up to now those kids has not been uh, released where are the muslim leaders where are the Hausa leaders if it if it is about the muslim law they would have ordered them if it's to honor life anyone that talk about the muslim religion the Hausa leader would have been shouting and tweeting everywhere Hausa people are not concerned about this. They are not saying anything about it. But this is abuse to your community. And still yet, none of you is doing anything about it. The only people even talking about it is the people you are up against. People you hate. The people you, you don't like. When it's election, you will not talk. Because they are not Muslim. You will not talk. Look at your children. Aousa community, the Muslim community for, of Nigeria, look at your children. You are not talking about it. These kids' parents, these kids' parents have to move to Abuja to stay on a computer building close to the cell that these children are. They don't even have money to, you know, to go and give them food because they have been there for like three months. Ha, God imagine how devastated these kids parents will be just seeing how their children is being treated just seeing how 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 just their kids in this condition i can't even wrap my head around how the mothers will feel just seeing how the nigerian government system is treating kids as a parent 
seeing your child in that kind of in that kind of condition i don't know i don't even know how to feel i don't even know how to feel the judge imagine this judge came out and said there was no children involved in this uh, a case we are all seeing children and this judge have the audacity to lie in the presence of everyone in press conference after after he judged the case this this judge have the goals to talk that these kids are not children that they are adults okay the president have let's okay the president have the have the audacity have the right have everything to say release those children but the judge that sat on his chamber looking at these kids how how kids in this condition have the mind to send to ask for 10 million b even the ig of police said that these kids are just pretending that these kids are just pretending okay these kids are pretending what about the the condition they are the one we are seeing the men the manorish kids the question called kids so are you trying to tell me that this is a pretend as well are you trying to tell me that this is a pretend as well nigerian police the ig of police the no turners whenever when if it's election now if it's to ring election you will register a, a 10 years old as 30 years old you will register a, a seven years old as a, a 40 years old if it's election if it's time to vote just for you to manipulate election you will register kids in your community for them to vote now look when is election you will speak you will start talking now see how they are treating your kids and you are not saying anything about it sometimes i don't i don't i don't even feel pity for how northerners are treated in nigeria the way northerners behave during election we are not supposed to even bring up their topic for real you see see none of them is saying anything they are not protesting they are not tweeting they are not saying anything about it but if it's election you will see massive ma massive northerners will come out they will register children they will do anything to make sure that a muslim is a leader the northerners are still the problem of nigeria till today because they have the population if the northerners decide to unite to march to federal government to fct they will do it now it's time for you to speak for now it's time for you to speak up for these innocent children you are not doing it but if it's time to to do election you will speak up or if it's time for to defend uh religion you will speak up where are the northern leaders these kids are from is it not from are they not from kaduna kaduna have emia why are the emia not speaking up why are the governors not speaking up why are people in the north still quiet about this injustice we are going to contribute i myself i'm going to contribute even if it's 10 if the government does not release this kit i will join the go for me account that very a very dark man is going to you know bring out we will contribute the money now and continue to be opening your nyash our celebrities are not talking about it too we have big celebrities that the youth is looking up to if any of our big celebrities is leading like vdm especially the ones with massive power the youth will turn their eye to politics but right now our our celebrities nothing about nothing about nigeria is their business because everyone is afraid everyone is afraid talk about nigeria government and go to prison 